welcome to this lecture in this lecture we'll discuss about feedback so uh, we are familiar with the term called feedback we have seen uh, different feedback circuits in amplifiers as well as in um, schmidt trigger kind of circuits and oscillators so we can actually classify feedback there are two types of feedback mm, positive feedback and negative feedback positive feedback is what we have seen in schmidt trigger now this unit uh, concentrates on negative feedback and that is a feedback in amplifier so we will concentrate on negative feedback that in amplifiers so whenever i say feedback a part of output signal is fed back to input and uh, depending on how we are feeding back we are classifying it as positive and negative positive feedback is otherwise known as regenerative feedback and negative feedback is otherwise known as degenerative feedback and in negative feedback a part of signal is fed back to part of output is fed back to input in opposition to the input signal for example if i consider an amplifier say having a gain of a and uh, say the input of the amplifier is vi and the output is vo now <clears throat> i can write the gain of the amplifier uh, specifically if there is no uh, feedback uh, here i can definitely write the gain and i can uh, call that gain as open loop gain because there is no uh, the amplifier is open loop input is fed and output there is no feedback given so i can uh, write the open loop gain as a and the open loop gain is nothing but output v not divided by vi so a is nothing but open loop of the open loop gain of the amplifier now <clears throat> if i am interested in giving a feedback what i will do is i'll take a part of output signal in order to get a part of output signal i'll take the output and i'll connect to uh, some network and i used to call that network as some beta network which could be a resistor network which can take a portion of the output uh, signal and now i'll feed this signal to the input in such a way that uh, in opposition with the actual input signal so what i'll do here is i will feed the signal back here in this way so that if this is your actual input if uh, vs now i am feeding a part of the signal back in the opposite that is i put a minus sign here so that <clears throat> a negative feedback is applied here how i can say negative feedback is a part of output signal we notice um, taken by using a feedback network beta and it is applied to the input side with the, in the opposite direction so if i write the um, so in the previous case when i had an open loop configuration i have written output by input as open loop gain now if i consider this system as a whole <clears throat> if i consider uh, this system as a whole and even if i write the gain expression i can write my gain as a gain is nothing but v not by v in so uh, here if we write uh, the gain expression uh, gain is nothing but v not by the input is vs actually here so the output of the system is v not and input is vs so what is v not by vs that will be the gain and i will call this gain as closed loop gain why because the system is now the system is not an open loop system i have connected a feedback network and this is nothing but a closed loop gain right now <clears throat> so we know that open loop gain is v not by vi now we will try to get an expression for v not by vs so for that what i can observe here is uh, i have taken a part of uh, output signal given through a feedback network and i'll call this as say some vf some feedback voltage now if i look at the voltage vi i can write vi as vi is uh, nothing but vs minus 
this feedback voltage right <coughs> that is your VA. VA is nothing but VS minus VF and if I write my VF here what is VF VF is actually a portion of output voltage or uh, I can write VF as beta is actually uh, the gain of this uh, box here so I can write VF as beta times V0 VF is nothing but beta times V0 and from the previous discussion I can write the relation between V0 and VI as V0 is equal to A times VI V0 is nothing but A times VI now combining all these things what I can write is V0 is equal to A into VI is VS minus VF so I will write Vs minus Vf is beta times V0. Right. Now if I uh, do a small simplification here, A times Vs minus A beta times V0. Or if I take V0 terms to the right side, V0 into 1 plus A beta is equal to A into Vs or I can write v naught by v s as a by 1 plus a bit so this is nothing but your gain with feedback v naught by v s or this i can call it as closed loop gain of the amplifier i will call this as with previous one was uh, gain with our open loop uh, feedback open loop gain i have written as a now closed loop gain I am writing it as AF and AF is nothing but it is A by 1 plus A beta. So if I look at the amplifier, <coughs> initially the amplifier gain was A. Now with the feedback the gain is actually reduced. Gain has become A by 1 plus A beta and this term, this 1 plus A beta, we used to call this as feedback factor. Sorry, 1 plus A beta is nothing but your uh, amount of feedback. Just to call this as amount of feedback. So, AF is closed loop gain, A is your open loop gain, 1 plus A beta is amount of feedback, uh, beta is your feedback factor. And this term A beta, we can call it as loop gain. Because if you look at the system, now the system is closed loop, right? Feedback is applied. So if I look around this system, the gain of the loop is nothing but A into beta. Right. So <clears throat> this is a very basic thing for a feedback. So without feedback, the gain we used to call it as open loop gain. And with feedback, the gain changes as A by 1 plus A beta. This is the basic thing what we need to know about a feedback and here the feedback is negative feedback so for a negative feedback system gain with feedback is nothing but a by 1 plus a beta so in next lecture we'll see uh, so what we have observed here is with feedback the gain actually reduced right so with feedback gain is actually reduced even though we are preferring negative feedback because of some advantages so we'll see what are the advantages of negative feedback and we'll see different configurations of negative feedback. Thank you.